Hello there, this video is about how to make a toy octopus which really can swim underwater. For this you need a plastic bottle, first take the plastic wrapper out, on the center of the cap drill a small hole, you need a 3 volt DC motor and a AAA battery holder, there are 2 pins to connect it, now the motor needs to get connected with the iron shaft, for this I have used a refill, as the pins refill diameter is more, just heat it up and pull it to get a narrower pipe, now this pipe fit with the motor shaft one side. On the other side fit the sap, so hit the iron sap little bit and push it. Now to fit the motor on the blue cap you need another small cap, glue the small cap first and fit the DC motor on top of it with the sap and glue it. You need another small cap like this make a drill at the center and be sure it is passing through the sap. Now you need to make a gel, for that you need Vaseline, take some Vaseline and you need some cotton strings. Cut the cotton string into small pieces and mix with this. Fill the small cap with this gel. This mechanism is very important, it will not allow the water to leak through the motor shaft hole to the inside of the bottle. Thus, the motor and the battery will be safe. Be sure that uh, it's going smoothly. Push it and then glue it with the blue cap. Now cut the propeller from an aluminium sheet and then glue a small piece of the refill pipe on top of Cut the extra length of the shaft and push the propeller into it. Now this is important, turn the both side of the propeller in opposite direction. Cut some thermocol uh, glue it at the front. Now you need a smaller plastic bottle. Cut the neck and cut at the middle. On the front side you have to cut eight triangular notches. On the back side I'm going to cut four big holes so that water can easily pass through. Now stick these with the blue cover. This will be an enclosure of the sap. Once the thermocol is dried, cut it with a knife to make the face of the octopus and then smooth it with a piece of sandpaper. Now I'm going to make the legs of the octopus. For this you need this kind of rubber sheet. Cut 8 pieces from it and then give a shape like this to make the legs. Paint all the leg like this and then stick it at the back side of the bottle. Now you start painting the whole bottle using fabric colors. I gave it a nice colorful look like this. Once dried, put the battery in, put some stone inside to make it heavy. Then connect the two pins, be sure the shaft is rotating freely and then fit the cap tightly. Now let's try on water. Put it on the water, it will be in the submerged condition and floating nicely all around. See, isn't it cool? I hope you liked.